Leng. 50. Is it 50? 51. 51. Phoebe is ready down at the starting grid. Phoebe? Yes, we are back on the grid for quick interviews here for MTRT Maxi Scooter Race 2. So as you can see, yellow dominated ang ating first row. I am next to Sean Barshal from Team JVT. Hi, Sean. Hello, po. Yes, pang ilang race mo na ba to today? Uh, pangalawa po. Okay, and how did you do during the first one? Uh, okay naman po yung first race uh, sniper. Uh, focus ngayon sa Maxi Scooter. Okay, so what is your game plan coming here? For the, for, for the second race? Uh, sana lang ng lang. Okay. And you're happy that you how do you feel that you're in Clark? Kumpara sa mga nakaraang race kasi batangas tayo doon. Oh, mas, mas masaya ako sa race track ngayon kasi gamay na gamay ko yung race track dito. Okay. All right. Sige. So good luck ha. Hope you maintain P1. Let's move on to P2. Kerwin Chang, also Team JVT. Hi Kerwin, pangilang race mo na today? Uh, pangalawa na. Pangalawa. Uh, How did you do? Happy ka ba sa performance mo nung una? Sa Underbo, happy naman po. Na-improve na namin yung motor. May onting problema lang pero subuan namin sa angkas. Okay. So, happy ka dito sa motor. Is this a different bike for a different category? Uh, uh, yeah. So, nakapag-practice ka naman dito sa Clark? Oo, oh, nakapag-practice naman. Maayos naman. Uh, sana okay na lahat. Okay. Na. Very good. Anong mentality mo ngayon? Ano ang gusto mong mangyari? Sa akin, Enjoy lang, enjoy lang karera. Bonus na yung kono mangyare pero gagawin ko lahat. Sempre yung pagod ng team ko, yes. lahat ay mga sumo support sa in. Yeah. Yeah. All right, good luck and uh, good job sa yung uh, very positive mentality. All right, let's move on to number three, Arman Salandanan. Hi Arman, kamusta sir? Okay naman po. Kumarera ka ba kanina ng umaga? Hindi na po eh. Bali yung kulay pa po namin kanina. So this is your first race for the day. So how are you feeling that you're in Clark? Medyo kabado po. Kasi mga magagaling po yung mga kalaban eh. P3 ka so magaling ka rin. <laughs> medyo po, medyo. Okay. So anong mentality, anong game plan ng ginawa niyo ng crew niyo? Uh, tinray lang po namin magtono nang hanggang sa makuha po namin yung gusto namin takbo. Okay. Yun po. Para po makasabay sa kanila. So nakainsayo ka naman ng maigi dito sa Clark. Opo, nakapag-insaya naman po. Simula ng Friday. Kaso po, umuulan eh. So, anong mga difficulties na na-experience na, na mo nung nag-time trial ka at saka nung practice? Wala naman po, wala naman. Okay lang naman. Alright. Confident? Confident. Alright, energy, let's go! <laughs> Good luck, be safe! Alright, let's move on. Are we moving on? Alright. Number 4, P4, we have Christian Anderson. Hi Christian, I love your last name. Anong lahi mo? Lahing Pilipino. Alright. Anderson. <laughs> Screen name mo ata yun. Racer name. Okay, so kamusta? Pang ilang race mo na to today? Uh, pangalawa. Okay. Pangalawa ko ngayon takbo to. Yes, and happy ka ba sa outcome nung una? Happy happy ako sa outcome nung una. Nakachamba kami. Alright. So ngayon nasa P4 ka. Anong iyong strategy para maging P1? Wala lang. Gusto ko lang, ano, pakabuntot sa kanila. Okay, okay. <laughs> Very good. Happy ka ba? Happy nga happy ako. Okay, ayos. So good luck ha. Mag Tapos na ito, mas happy ako. Okay, bakit? <laughs> Sana makapesto kami. <laughs> makapesto ka. Nakapesto ka na eh. Alright, let's move on to P5. JP Kapili. Hi JP. How are you feeling? We're in Clark now. Nung mga nakaraan, Batangas. Pa anong pakiramdam sa'yo? Yung, ano, malaki din po yung adjustment. Ang laki nung truck. Yeah. Kaya po medyo nahirapan din magtono. Pero kung papipiliin ka, mas gusto mo Batangas o dito? Halos same lang din po sila eh. May, may struggle din po talagang sa pag ice ng motor. Okay. So anong nakikita mong uh, biggest struggle being in Clark? Uh, yung mga kalaban po natin, puro expert talagang ano. Ang hirap po sumabay, pero pipilitin po natin. Yes, kayang-kaya mo yan. Mindset lang, right? Okay, so ano advice mo sa viewers mo, sa iyong fans? Uh, wish me luck. Pray nyo ka ako. Good luck, ah. Good luck, JP. All right, marami tayong oras ngayon. Let's move on to EJ Sobretodo from Team Angkas. Hi, EJ. Kamusta? Kamusta? Ah, uh, okay naman. Ah, uh, medyo nairapan lang kanila sa 400 kasi biglang bumagsak yung ulan. Ah, uh, settings kasi ng motor ko pang tuyo. So, nagano na lang ako, nag-points na lang ako kasi may sumemplang din sa likuran, sa harapan ko. Hindi na ako 
humabol pa kasi baka mas 0 points ako. Kaya bawi na lang sa race to. Tsaka ngayon, maintain lang muna yung sa points kasi leading ako dito sa overall championship. Yes. Kaya play safe lang muna ngayon. Yeah, at saka uh, from our past conversations, ang dami mo talagang race na sinasalihan. Sa so, tingin mo ba, uh, nakarat, nakadating na sa'yo yung pressure of all these races? Uh, hindi naman, kasi katulad din naman ng dati. Ang um, pinagkaiba lang ngayon, medyo may iniinda lang dahil nga sa injury na nakaraang araw. Yeah. Pero kaya pa rin mag adjust Adjust na ng adjust hanggang sa matapos yung karera. May yeah. mga susunod pa namang karera. Kaya focus na muna ngayon. Huwag masyado ma-pressure. Focus na sa laro. So ganun ka mag-cope, kailangan hindi ka masyado ma-pressure, no? Apo, yun lang. Ganun lang dapat kasi damo na naman ma-pressure, mahirap naman lumaro eh. Tama. And about your bike, kasi lumiyab ka mo, no? So pinalitan ba totally? Anong ginawa sa bike mo? Uh, yung sa 400 ko, pinalitan na kasi sunog talaga siya totally. So yung ginamit ko mo to sa 400, yung kay Troy. Okay. Tapos yung nakaredy na yung spare bike ko kung sakaling may problema pa mangyari. Kaya ayun na muna yung ginamit ko sa ngayon. Okay, aso ah, pinahiram sa yung bike ni Troy Alberto. Yes, All right, that's very nice. Okay, kasi parehas kayong ambassador ng Angkas. Opo, kaya ayun wala rin naman si Troy ngayon. Uh, pinahiram din sa akin ng Alberto family kaya thank you so much sa Alberto family. Talagang sinusuporta na ako lalo na Sir George. Kaya bawi lang muna ngayon kasi may dalawang race pa. Focus na muna sa overall champion. Tama. All right. Good luck EJ. Okay? And smile. Medyo low energy ka today but it's okay. Babawi tayo. All right. Let's move on to P7. Dre Tabakero. Ayan. Parang first time ko lang siyang makausap. Hello sir. Excuse me. Pa-interview lang po ah. Hello. Hi Dre. Kamusta? Okay naman. Okay naman. Yeah. You look a little cheery. How are you feeling now you're in Clark? Ah. Uh, Medyo kinakabahan. <laughs> yeah? Pero kaya-kaya naman. Kaya-kaya. Uh, Pang ilang race mo na ba ngayong araw? Uh, isa pa lang. Isa lang. Isa pa lang. So, ka, paano kayo nag-prepare nag ng crew? Uh, yun, sa ano, sa makina. Nag-prepare kami nung kahapon. Yeah. Tsaka nag-tune kami ng mga panggilid, ganyan. Para okay. sa race track. Kasi okay. iba yung club tsaka sa last na kinarerahan namin. Yeah. So, happy and confident ka naman. Medyo umaambon na ulit. So, paano yan? Kaya kaya, kahit maulan o maraw, kaya kaya. That's the right mentality. All right, thank you very much, Dre. Let's move on to P8. Mukhang lahat may interview natin. 40 lahat to, ha? <laughs> Hello, uh, Jeffrey Chupenko. Hi, sir. Kamusta po? Uh, okay naman. Medyo nakikisama yung panahon. <laughs> Actually, Actually, nagsisimula ng umambon, may kinakasal na tikbalang ata, no? Yeah, so, paano ka mag-ano dito, mag-adjust uh, kapag biglang umulan mid-race? Eh, ganun pa rin. Siyempre, parang normal. Yeah. Alalay nga lang. Alalay. Pero mentality mo, mindset, na stress ka ba? Or na anong nangyayari? Nagpapanik ka? Sakto lang naman. Okay. Eh, walang ka ba? Kapag uh, chill lang. Yeah. Okay, at least nakapractice ka naman dito sa Clark, no? Yes. Mentality, ano strategy mo? Eh, basta bakbak lang. Okay. Gas pool. <laughs> Mahilig sa bakbakan. Alright, back to you guys. <laughs> Maraming salamat, uh, Phoebe Walker. And it looks like this is going to be a wet race. <laughs> it is? Mula na ba? It's starting to. It's starting to come down. Um, oh, seven laps. Seven laps. 40 riders. Over 40 riders. Could be interesting. Could be very interesting. Uh, such a large grid, and uh, if the if the rain does come down even more, uh, we'll see. This, this should be an action-packed uh, race. Once again, this is the MTRT Maxi Scooter 185 class with quite 50 a riders. fifty riders. Fifty-one, I think. Riders. Fifty-one and fifty-one riders. My goodness. Sama ba yung three, four, five? Yung mga walang pangalan. On on our hard copy, it's forty-five. Forty-five. Yeah. Looks like uh, forty-five riders. Forty-five riders. forty-five riders. And ito nga. It looks like the rain has. Uh, although, medyo ambon lang pan ambon palang. Yeah, kung ambon, pwede pa yan. Pwede pa. Si Kapin pa yan. 15 minutes of racing so I'm sure aabutan sila ng konting ambon and if you're EJ sobre todo sabi nga niya kanina he just wants to protect his lead and uh, score some points wala pong warm up though this is the start of the race already there you go okay 
And one of the JVT riders, they're falling behind right oh, there in the very start. Starting, oh. Very poor start, unfortunately, for his, uh, for his team. Let's look at the number of riders yeah, there are on the, on the main street here. It's really important to get uh, ahead of everybody. Yeah, good start. Interesting that. See yellow what in JVT? That's JVT, yes. Yellow, yellow and black. Always yeah. representing. Yeah, no, it's a lot That's uh, over at the uh, corkscrew. You see there, there is a rider in between uh, the JVT riders. Talagang pagbakan to ah. At mukhang umuulan na. Oh wow, look at this. I mean, that's... Let me get a confirmation outside who pa. that is. Uh, but he took it on the outside. Let's see if we can confirm it. If that is Irvin Abasta. Who has overtaken both uh, Kerwin Chang and Shan Barshal? But uh, Team JVT making a move here in the back straight as both of them get past. Who could possibly be Irvin Abasta? Nine teamwork. Yeah, and teamwork between the JVT riders. Pero uh, outside the naman siya. Followed by EJ on a blue and white bike representing Angkas Color. Ah, be puro outside tung. This is the MTRT Maxi Scooter 185 class. As they head towards the start finish into the last turn. Looks like that is Irvin Abasta leading the way. Wow. Leading Sean Barshal and Kerwin Chang. Followed by Arman Salandanan. It's <laughs> camera, Droplets na. And here we go. That's Dre Tabaquero leading the way, followed by Sean Barshal, Kerwin Chang. That's your top three. Arman Salandan and P4, John Paul Capili, P5, and EJ Sobretodo, top six at the moment. As you see, the five riders ahead going down the corkscrew. And then the second batch of riders, EJ Sobretodo is leading the way there. Sabi nga ni EJ kanina, he just wants to protect, get some points to protect that lead of his for the overall championship of the season. So medyo may strategy na siya, no? Uh, um, the long-term goal kasi championship nga uh -oh. naman to, hindi naman to for race. Meron na siyang enough gap kasi yung mga leaders naman ngayon, uh, si Kerwin and si Sean, may mga ilang race sila na hindi sila nakakuha ng points. Uh, DNF or NR? DNF. Oh. So, meron naman siya ngayon enough gap na hindi na niya kailangang i-risk kung hindi okay yung pace niya ngayon. Kailangan mata matapos niyang uh, nakatayo yung motor. Yes. Kasi at 4th place, that's 18 points, I think. 25, 23, ah, 22, 20, and then 18 points. Tama, 18 points. So Dre Tabaquero looking strong here with six laps to go. And the track looks like it is still dry enough. Yeah. As of now, it's still dry enough. But with six laps to go, who knows what the situation will be like. So you can see there are there is rain coming down already. Medyo, ano to, hindi pa natin alam. Pero yung important dyan is to, ano, no? to avoid yung painted areas. Yes. yes. Yung, uh, especially yung mga apex. And puddles. Yeah. So may puddles. part yung trucks na, truck na may mga ano na nag-iipon ng tubig kasi. 
Tapos yung dinaanan kanina ni TJ, syempre wag doon. So it's still Dre Tabacero, P1, but Sean Barshal now with the fastest lap time, 227.9. He is at P2, followed by Kerwin Chang, his teammate and Team JVT. And you see the flag there, the yellow and orange flag that was being waved. Nipo yon ano, race over. That means uh, be careful because it's a wet. Caution. Caution. Lomac, if you're watching, please take note. Yeah. Ano niya, race dan. Talaga to si Lomac. That is Dre Tabacero, followed by Sean Barshal and Kerwin Chang. This is our last race before our lunch break. And hopefully this afternoon the weather will still hold or maybe dry up even. Yep. Although some riders prefer it pag basa, no? Some riders, mm. sabi nga ni Dashi sa kani Marvin kanina, gusto nila medyo wet race. Mm. But Trey Tabacero, not... Oy. Doesn't seem like he really cares much whether it's wet or dry. So there was a little bit of a wiggle there yeah. at Akasha. Here they are in the big sea. He's being followed by Sean Barshal. Barshal trying to make a move here. Kerwin Chang looks like there's a little bit of an issue with his bike. He's fallen back a couple of uh, spots. Unfortunately, this is not the first time we've seen this happen to Kerwin, Kerwin. Chang. Mm -hmm. But he was top three, top two in this race, but he has fallen far uh, off of that right now. So right now... Sean Barshal alone in, from Team JVT. Wala na yung teammate niya. Sabi, hanggang ngayon may pumapasok pa na oras sa dami. Okay, keeping the lead. Trey Tabacero, Sean Barshal, JP Kapili, Arman Salandanan. That's your top four. JC Mercado, P5. EJ Sobretodo, P6. And we can see the weather, no? Umaaraw na naman. Napakahigirap talaga. If you're a rider, if you're a team, trying to plan for this weather mm -hmm. is really, really difficult. And these top four riders, you can, they're all bunched up together. Look at them, the four of them just taking a Porsche. Dang. May ilig sa outside si Dre. And right now, Sean Barshal leading the race. As they make their way to the back straight. Wala yung apat sa buong 45 yeah. And there's quite a gap between the four of them and everybody else. And that's bike number 12 ahead right now. Bike number 12 is JP Kapili. He is followed by Dre Tabacero and Sean Barshal. That is your top three at the moment. Yung four rider group lead. Na lang sila yeah, matira -mati uh -oh. No technical issues. John Paul Capilli on your screens right now on bike number 12. He just set the fastest time of the of the race. And he's now in P1. So he's uh, his, he clocked in at 227. Mm -hmm. 
But Sean Marshall gaining on him here as he crosses the start finish line. But with three laps to go, it's JP Kapili P1, Dre Tabaquero P2, Sean Marshall P3, Arman Salandan P4, followed by JC Mercado. Now uh, EJ Sobretodo has uh, catapulted himself uh, to P3. Podium spot. Podium spot for the Ancas Rider. Very good. So it looks like EJ really prefers it pag gano, no? Pag dry. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm. Mas relax siya kasi may ano siya eh. May uh, enough lead. But the battle for the top spot is between these two at the moment. Sean Barshal and the Team JVT, he is in the yellow bike, yellow suit. He is trailing bike number 12, John Paul Capili. So it, as it stands, JP Capili, Dre Tabaquero. Talagang pabago-bago dito sa ganitong race, no? So they started with 45 riders, then we saw five guys break away from everybody. Then that five became four, three, now it's down to two. That's John Paul Capili followed by Sean Barshal. And everybody else a little bit further behind. And here they go. Last turn, heading to the start finish line. It is still JP Kapili, P1, with two laps to go. Sean Barshal, P2. And nag-work pa yung strategy ni EJ na on a, on a podium spot in mm -hmm. third place. EJ sobre oh. the P3 at the moment. Good 20 points again for him. Lalakihan niya talaga yung lead. Look at the at the track. No, I mean from from where we are, there's bikes everywhere. Yes. <laughs> it's just such a big grid. Yes. There's something happening in every corner of the racetrack. But this is what we have to pay attention to as our top two riders are reaching the back markers now. In the back straight, will this favor anyone? We don't know just yet, but you can expect the blue flags to be out. It's excellent racing between these two, Sean Barshal and uh, John Paul Capili. It's still Kapili leading the way. Taking a quick look to see how far away Sean Barshal is. And Sean Barshal said, I am right here. Last lap for our two riders approaching start and finish. Final lap. 
So how far is uh, si Sobre Todo? Nine seconds difference. So it's John Paul Capilli followed by our screens say Dre Tabaquero. And that's the race leaders right there. Catching up to more back markers. That is bike number 97. That's Sean Barshal. And bike number 12, John Paul Capilli battling it out there for the top spot. That's Sean Barshal there, the J Team JVT rider, bike number 97. Currently, your race leader. You see the blue flag para padanin now na. And it looks like it's race over. It looks like it is race over for John Paul Capilli. He had to pull to the side there. Uh, very unfortunate there. He was battling with. Uh, Sean. Sean Barshal. Oh no. And very unfortunate. It looks like it was going to be them 1 2. Not, and you see the frustration as uh, Sean Barshal will celebrate a race win. Which means, sobre todo, naging third or second. It looks like. Sean Barshal is P1, Dre Tabaquero P2, John Paul Capilli is there. It is. Now it's EJ Sobre Todo because John Paul Capilli expected to yes. fall down further because he's not gonna finish the race. So third, but in C Sobre Todo. Sobre todo.